Hello and welcome to my channel, Leo. Thank you once again for joining me. This is your December romance reading. And um, as I've said in my videos that I've done for this month, I, again, apologize for the makeshift setup that I've got here. I'm redecorating my original location and so it's not quite ready and this is where I'm at. <laughs> um, nevertheless, I'm very excited to be doing your December romance reading at this time, guys. And as always, if you're interested in a personal private reading, please access all that information down below. All right, so let's go ahead and get started, Leo, for this month of December. My goodness, I cannot believe this year is almost done, guys. All right, let's get started. So angels, please bring forth your messages for my Leos or for anyone who has simply been guided to watch this video. All right, let's see what messages come through for you guys. For Leo angels, what messages would you care to share for Leo at this time? Okay, a couple more shuffles. All right. Okay, Leo, what's happening? So angels, please bring forth your messages for Leo at this time. What messages would you like to share for Leo for this month? Okay, guys, so we're starting off with religious factors. Religious factors coming through. Okay, let's pull some more, okay. We have free yourself, falling out of the deck here. Okay, let's see what that's about. For Leo, what's happening? It's month of December. Pay attention to the red flags, Leo. What is happening here? Right next to free yourself. Okay, we've got some jumpers here. We've got, this could be the one. I'm trying to get rid of this glare here. Okay. Nice, worth waiting for. Worth waiting for, right next to this could be the one. Give your relationship a chance. All right, Leo, let's pull some more. We have heart-to-heart -heart conversations jumping out of the deck. You guys are having jumpers right now. Okay, couple more. It is safe for you to love. Okay, one more card for Leo Angels, please. There we go. All jumpers, guys. Attraction coming through for all my Leos. Bottom card is reconciliation. Someone wants to come back into your life, Leo. Who is it? Okay, so please give me a second to assess the cards that came through for you for this month, okay? All right, Leo, you, you guys are another sign that I the angels are guiding me to read your messages horizontally, so I will follow their lead. Okay, so we're starting off with religious factors here. I'm praying, Leo, that the energy I'm feeling is that you've really experienced challenges in a relationship in the past. One that really broke your heart, I'm feeling. But one that strengthened you as well. I mean, there was a time when really those red flags were rampant and you saw the caution signs and that connection and you prayed about it. You prayed for guidance in order to make the right decision what do you do? Do you stay? Do you go? And I feel the energy that for some of you guys, that whoever this is coming through for, you really fought with yourself because you're not the type of person to just give up on a relationship and you fought for it. But at the end of the day, it just really was too challenging and it just was not working. And so as a result of some major soul searching, you freed yourself from that connection, that relationship, you took back control of your life, Leo. And I really feel for some of you that this is resonating with. 
you haven't looked back. You experienced it, it broke your heart, you learned from it, and you've moved on. So now moving forward into the present position, this could be the one. I'm feeling, for those of you who really took the time to move beyond that past energy, your prayers have been answered because you are with the person you're meant to be with. And you really do feel they were worth waiting for. You really do feel, regardless of the fact that the soulmate card didn't come through in this spread, I still feel that the energy that they, they really are meant for you and that they are your soulmate. Divine timing is at work in your love life to bring you guys together, back together. I'm feeling this is someone that you've known in the past and that you reconnected with as confirmed by this reconciliation card. Okay. And you guys are really giving it a go. You're really giving your relationship a chance to thrive. You're putting a lot of your energy into working on this partnership, Leo. And the energies coming through from this is really wonderful. And you're happy and feeling really good, happy energy, Leo. Moving forward into the future, I do feel that this connection that you're pre you've made presently, this person that is the one for you, your soulmate, you guys really take the time to have those heart-to-heart -heart conversations. You really take the time. You've gotten to know each other very well, and you're going to continue to do that into the future to continue to deepen your bond with each other. You're open and honest with discussing your feelings with one another, and that is what will help your relationship to sustain itself long-term. Absolutely, it is safe for you to love this person this person okay it's allowing you to finally experience the type of love that you were meant to experience leo far detached from th the previous relationships that you had experienced to where there were red flags tension challenges to where you felt you needed to free yourself and to gain back control of your life because you felt out of control at that time that is not the case now, I'm feeling, for some of you. And the attraction with this relationship that you are in, for those of you that this is resonating with, it's intense. Yep, there is such a great, intense attraction between you and this individual that you have reconciled with through this reconciliation. They are the one for you. They are your soulmate. And it's this attraction that will follow you through, throughout the years. And I really feel long-term connection. I, I see forever with this spread here. The energy's coming through. For those of you who really feel this happiness, heading into the holidays especially, it's going to be a very happy time for you. I'm feeling Leo. And that's wonderful. So those are the messages coming through for the Romance Angels. Let's go ahead and pull some healing messages to add to this. So angels, please bring forth your healing messages for Leo at this time, reflective of the month of December 2017. Please bring it forth for Leo at this time. Okay. All right, angels, what messages would you like to share with Leo at this time? Okay, we have a jumper. All right. Nice. Serenity. When you're happy and fulfilled, you really are in a state of serenity. You're content. What a beautiful card to come through for Leo, especially this month of December, a month of, full of love and togetherness, happiness, family, the holidays. You're content, happy. Bottom of the deck is truth and integrity. You maintained your integrity because you sought your truth. 
you wanted to live your truth. And the way you achieved that was by freeing yourself from the past where things really were so out of control and you needed to regain balance in your life. And you did the work, Leo, to regain that balance. And so now here you are in a state of serenity. For those that this is coming through for, you know exactly what this means. Okay, so let's close out your reading, guys, for December with angel answers. So for those of you that I feel have been really needing an answer to a question that's been weighing pretty heavily on your mind, please clear your mind of any negative energy, take a deep breath, and just focus on the one question that you would like an answer to from the angels. Okay, so let's concentrate on that. Angels, please bring forth your message for my Leos who really need an answer to the question that's been weighing heavily on them at this time. Please bring forth clarity and guidance for my Leos. Answer. Can you offer us? Okay, here we go. Wow, the answer is yes. For those of you needing a straightforward answer to your question, the answer is yes. Since this is a romance reading, if you've been thinking of asking someone to marry you, the answer is yes. Go for it. If You've been contemplating a partnership, a relationship, perhaps a career move. The answer is yes. Go for it. You can't go wrong. That is the energy coming through from this card. Go for it. Okay. And the bottom card is separate scenario. It's not the right time. Okay. So those of you needing a time frame in regard to a challenging situation that you've been facing. The angels are coming through to affirm that you need to have a little bit of patience still. Just hang in there and don't be hasty about a decision that you've been wanting to make because there's something better for you by waiting. It's not the right time, so just hang in there. Okay? So those are my messages for Leo at this time, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And again, for those of you needing a personal private reading, please um, access the information down below to um, request that. And I'd be happy to do a personal reading for you guys. So um, until next time, happy holidays to all of you. And I'll see you again in January. Thank you guys. Bye-bye.